What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Film study for rookies. Today we're breaking down Raiders quarterback, rookie quarterback at that, Aiden O'Connell. But before we jump into the film, let's point out a couple things first. One, this just defense is top five, all right? The second thing is he has Devontae Adams on his team. As you're going to see in this film, he has a tendency to either look at Adams first or not really look at Adams at all. So Keep those couple things in mind, man. Let's jump into the film. First play we're going to look at right here. Ironically, they bring Adams in motion. A little RPO with Jacobs. Adams on the outside. I like this play a lot. For one, you get the rookie quarterback easy throws to make, right? Build up his confidence. Two, you give Devontae Adams the ball. And three, you basically set this up later. Or if the defense bites over here with Devontae going in motion, bam, you hit Jacobs on the outside over here. So I like this play a lot to start the game, man. Let's keep it going. Good stuff right there. All right, guys, on this play, it's about third and four. Raiders run a mesh concept underneath. They're not going to get the first down. This play definitely had potential. There's a couple things potentially we could have done different. Let's run it back real quick. All right, guys, as we break down this play, the first person you're going to want to watch is the mic right here. That's who Aiden's going to stare at. So right here, you're going to see, bam, the mic is going to pick up Jacobs right there. Now, if you ask me, Aiden gives up on this play a little bit too soon. Jacoby right here, he's going to run a great rub route, as you're going to see. Take a look at this. We're going to let it develop a little bit. Bam. Jacoby does a great job. Look how much separation that is for Jacobs right there. I think Aiden gave up on this play a little too soon. All right. So if he's not going to Jacobs, obviously you see him progressing through his reads. Tight end's not open. All right. We have our mesh concept right here. So now you expect Hunter to basically hit Gardner right there, create separation for Devontae. But watch what happens right here. Take a look. Hunter misses that right there. He misses that chip right there. Bam. That's going to allow Sauce to stay with Devontae right there. And they come a yard, yard and a half short right there. So there is definitely potential on this play. A couple things to work on. Let's keep it going. On this play right here, this was beautifully executed, man. Beautifully executed. Aiden's going to drop back. Hit Devontae over the top, man. we got to break this play down because this was nice right here. So as we take a look at this play pre-snap, they had two high safeties, right? He's going to drop down, pick up the tight end over here, right? So take a look what happens right here. Bring the tight end in motion. Bam. Single high safety now. So a potential looks like cover three. Bang, 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 right? They've all got a third. Now watch how Devontae runs this route. Take a look right here. He doesn't immediately go right to the middle linebacker because if he does, the mic's obviously going to travel with him, right? So Devontae slows this thing down. Take a look. Boom, boom, boom. And then bam, turns it on. Look at that stuff, man. That is beautiful right there. Beautiful right there, man. And then you see Aiden hits him over the top. I mean, this was this was perfect right there, right? You bring the tight end, bam, safety comes down. These guys right here bite on the play action a little bit, as you're going to see. Then immediately, they turn their back right. They're like, oh, don't want to get beaten zone. Devontae slips behind him, as you're going to see right there. And he had no idea Devontae was behind him. Good stuff right there, man. Good stuff. Let's keep it going. All right, guys, on this play right here, Raiders run a screen. Now, this play had a lot of potential. We're going to break down why in a second. I mean, that's just honestly one hell of a tackle. So right here, Raiders bring a mirror in motion. Now, the linebacker is going to come over here. Now, the Raiders are actually going to get the look they want. So right there, a little jog, jog, jog. Once the ball is snapped, we're going to pause it right about here. Right here, everything looks good. He's picked up. He's picked up. He's picked up. Potential lead block right there for the safety. Everything looks good, right? Let the play develop. If he takes that thing back inside, I mean, that's probably six, right? That might be six. But as you're going to see, Michael right here with this block just doesn't take the best position right here, right? Basically takes himself out of the play and lets the linebacker tackle him. If Michael picks up that block right there, that might be six. So overall, another good play, right? Let's keep it going. Man, this play right here, this is crazy. This is just, this is nuts. I mean, what? When I saw this, I was like, there's no way. There is no way Devontae just did this. This is <laughs> this is wild right there. We're going to pause it right there. I mean, what? This is, bruh, come on, man. That's, that's just not fair. That That's just not fair, man. Let's keep it going. All right, guys, on this play, this is another third down where the Raiders came up just a little bit short. Let's run this play back and see, did we miss anything potentially? So as you're going to see, they're going to bring Hunter in motion. Now, here's what they're trying to do, right? They bring Hunter in motion. They want the defense to basically drop down on Hunter, bam, tight end, bang, bang, right, for the first down. That's ideally what you want. But as you can see, man, this linebacker right here, he doesn't bite too hard on Hunter, which is smart, right? You want to guard the marker right here. So he doesn't bite too hard on that. So as you're going to see, he's sitting right there. He's waiting for the tight end to catch it. And as you're going to see, once again, he's a little short. 
Now, with that being said, hindsight's always 20-20, but take a look up here with Devontae, man. Right here, Devontae. I mean, that's probably a first down. Now again, he's got three reads over here that was getting pressure, so maybe he didn't have time to look to his left. But man, he misses Devontae right there. That's, that's crazy, because as you're going to see, man, this looks like a tough throw either way. If he looks back to his left, I mean, that's probably a first down. Like I said before, things happen, man. Let's keep it going. All right, guys, on this play, this is one of those things where I was talking about sometimes he stares at Devontae a little too much, right? Just a little too much. And it goes back to what I said, too, at the beginning of the video. This is the Jets' defense. This is probably top five in the league. And he's got Devontae on his team. So when you're playing one of the best defenses and you stare at one guy too long, this is going to happen eventually, right? If we break this play down, you could say, all right, well, he doesn't really stare at Devontae. The problem is... Safety right here is watching Devontae and watching the quarterback. Aiden never really takes his eyes off where he's going to throw it, right? Take a look at this. I mean, for a second, he looks over here at this safety. But for the most part, he's going to stare right here the whole time, right? Take a look. Essentially, stares right there the whole time. That's nothing for the safety. He doesn't have to drop back at all, right? There's no back pedal. This right here is just a safety easily breaking on that ball once Aiden releases that thing, man. Take a look. Once Aiden releases this... Safety's coming up. Devontae, he hasn't even finished his route yet, man. He hasn't even finished, hasn't came out of that cut, and it's picked off. Just something for Aiden to work on in the future. Let's keep it going. On this play right here, you got Devontae going in motion. Aiden's going to see single high safety. He sees it right there, and for some reason, he doesn't throw it until it's too late. Let's run this play back real quick. So as we break the play down, you got Devontae going in motion right there, right? Take a look right here. We're going to pause it. It looks like man-to-man -man coverage, but, you know, sometimes things happen. So right there, the ball snapped. Aiden looks to his left. Take a look. He looks to his left, comes back to the middle, looks at Devontae. To me, I'm a little confused why he doesn't throw that. He sees the safety right here sitting in the middle. You got Devontae right here one-on-one -on -one with the DB. It's not sauce. I'm not sure why Aiden doesn't trust himself to throw this ball right there. He hesitates, comes back to his left, but I'm not sure why he doesn't throw it to Devontae right here. You got the safety right where you want him. Give Devontae a chance. I think that pick may have worn on him mentally, potentially. Let me know what you guys think right there. He's going to throw it up, which isn't the smartest throw right there, but, you know, things happen. I think maybe that pick got to him. Let me know what you guys think. Let's keep it going. On this play right here, there's a lot of good, a little bad, but for the most part, it was good, right? He progresses through all of his reads, hits Devontae right there. I mean, that was one hell of a throw, but did it have to be that tough? Let's run this back real quick. So as we break this play down, let's talk about the good. The first good's going to be over here on Jacoby, right? Take a look. Once the ball snapped, he looks to his left. All right, Jacoby's picked up. It looks like potentially cover four from the Jets. Bang, bang, bang. Quarters across, right? So to me, his next read has to be the middle. Four over the top defenders, three underneath. All right, bam, hit that right there, right? Both these safeties are backpedaling. This is going to be money. For some reason, Aiden chooses not to make that throw. <laughs> to me, this is money. He's coming up. He's going back. That's money right there, right? Instead, he makes a very difficult throw to Devontae. I mean, he put that thing on a laser. I mean, whoo. This throw, man. This is... This throw right there. That's crazy. All right, guys. This is one of those plays where I think he watched Devontae too long, man. And right there, you're going to see he's going to get sacked. Now, what am I talking about? He watched Devontae too long. Let's run it back. So as we break this play down, we got Sauce lined up over Devontae right here. Take a look what happens right here. Once the ball is snapped, bam, bam, you got Sauce right on Devontae. To me, just hit Jacobs right there, right? Devontae's picked up. You know the route. It's going to be hard for Devontae to get open right there. The next thing is, is all right, you don't want to go to Jacobs even though he's open. Go to the tight end over the top. This defender's going this way, bam, right? Make the next read. Like I said before, I think sometimes he just focuses too much on Devontae and takes a sack right there. I think right here, man, you got to go to your tight end. He's going to be open. Devontae's picked up right there. Let me know what you guys think. Let's keep it going. Move on to the next one. All right, guys. Unfortunately, the same thing it looks like is going to happen right here. Aiden's waiting for Devontae to get open. Holds on to it for too long. He throws it away. You don't lose any yards, but let's break this play down real quick. We're going to pause it at the top of his drop. All right, right here. Devontae, he's not really open. If he throws it here, bang. DB right here, he's going to pick it up. Throws it over here. I mean, no matter where he goes with this ball right here, it's going to be hard for Aiden to hit him. So what else does Aiden have? Let's run this back real quick. Take a look. 
Well, for one, once again, man, we got the running back out of the backfield. We got to take that. The second thing is Hunter going right across the middle. You saw this defender right here, the linebackers. They're both going to drop back, right? Take a look. Go to Hunter right there across the middle, right? Or check it down. Like I said before, I think sometimes he just focuses too much on Devontae. He doesn't lose any yards, but, I mean, he had people open right there. Let's keep it going. This play right here shows you the potential of Aiden and Devontae, right? That route running, the timing, the ball placement, I mean, that's all money, right? Let's run it back real quick. So as we break this play down, we're going to pause it around the top of his drop. Take a look right here. We're going to pause it right about here. DB is actually playing pretty good coverage. He's ready to break right here, but watch what Devontae does, right? Take a look. Devontae gets him to take that extra step backwards and bam, Devontae cuts. Woo! That's money. That throw was perfect, too. That throw is perfect. Good stuff right there, man. Let's keep it going. On this play right here, it looks like Jets sitting in that cover two, and Aiden just holds on to it too long, waiting for Devontae to get open. Let's run it back. So as we run this play back, I thought the Jets were sitting in cover two at first, but it looks like potentially quarters, right? If it was cover two, Sauce wouldn't be going back here, right? Instead, he would be playing the flat. But as you're going to see, this defender right here, he's going to come over. you got the mic right there. And it looks like the DB over here is actually going to travel with Devontae. Now, I'm guessing Aiden thought it was going to be cover two. That's why he held on to it for so long. But as you're going to see, man, the DB is going to travel with Devontae. That might have just been an assignment for the Jets, right? Whoever's lined up on the side with Devontae, you travel with him no matter what, right? As you're going to see, man, he has a tight end wide open across the middle, right? I mean, once again, man, just a little too focused on Devontae, as you're going to see. Things happen, man. Hopefully it gets better next week. Let's keep it going. Right here, it's third down. Raiders run that mesh concept underneath again. And once again, no success. Now, you could call holding on sauce potentially, but if we look at the overall play call, let's run this back real quick. So the first thing we want to look at is the running back coming out of the backfield. Does that get picked up? As you're going to see right there, bam, outside the linebacker right here, he picks up the running back. Now we have the mesh concept coming underneath. So take a look. The tight end, he's going to try and run that rubber right there. As you're going to see, sauce is going to hold on to Devontae to avoid that. There's no way he's not holding right there. There's just no way. Then the next thing you're going to see is Hunter. He's going to try and do the same thing. Sauce, once again, avoids that. And yet, he's still in contact with Devontae. To me, the ref has to throw that thing. As for the overall play call, I think the Raiders have to mix it up a little bit. Because once again, man, this, this didn't work. I'm guessing they've been doing this a little bit this season. And teams have caught on to it, right? They know what to expect. I mean, Sauce knows what to expect again from Hunter right there. Let me know your thoughts, guys. Let's keep it going. All right, guys. On this play, this is where they score a touchdown. But this is one of those plays where I was like, all right. I'm not sure what happened. But, oh, my. What a throw. Right? What a throw right there. All right, guys. On this play, you got Aiden under center. They run the play action. Jets, single high safety playing cover one, it looks like. And Aiden throws it up to Devontae and doesn't come down with it. Now, Let's run this back real quick. So as we break this play down, I've gone back and forth with this a few times, right? They run the play action, as you're going to see, bang, we're going to pause it right here. Aiden sees the single high safety playing this side over here. So he can choose to go to Devontae on the double team or give his receiver over here a shot. I think to me, he has to give this receiver a shot over here. All right, guys, right here is going to be our last play. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Look, all I'm going to say is this. This kid has an arm. I think sometimes... He looks at Devontae too much, and sometimes, like this play, he doesn't look at Devontae, right? Take a look right here. Jets, both those linebackers come up. Bang, bang. They come up on that play action. Ooh, they come up. Devontae, right across the middle, he's open. But as you're going to see, Aiden doesn't look that way. Now, this isn't a bad read that he makes, per se, but you have Devontae wide open across the middle, right? Just a couple things for Aiden to work on. Let me know what you guys think. I'm curious to see what happens next week. Do we get different plays on third down? I'll catch you guys on the next one. Take it easy. More content coming soon.